There's one more thing on the forehand that I don't yeah. like. It's the following thing. You get a ball, your first move is to go on the bottom here. And then you go up in the loop. So it's kind of like a forehand from the 90s. Like, yeah. I, when I was a junior, I actually hit my forehand that way. Yeah. When I grew up playing way yeah. back, way back in the day. Late 80s, early 90s, that's how my forehand used to be. Yeah, it's like the Ivan Lendl forehand. So I'm going, I'm going like this to the loop position. Yes. Instead of, instead of straight. Yes, absolutely, right yes. So you're going here, here first, first move, and then you raise the racket up. It's not optimal because now, yeah, listen, the racket has to go up and then back down. It's not as fluid, not, that, not as continuous right. as going like immediately from the top to the bottom. So the first move you make is going top. Okay, excellent. You see what I mean? I totally see. The first move you make, yeah, when you make your, your turn, mm -hmm. you, you keep the racket up. And then from there, you will drop it in the back. Everything else stays the same. The only difference you're making is like, go in your ready position. Okay, now forehand comes, you go here, and that's it. That's the only change you need to make. And not... Not, for, not first down and then up. Okay. okay, let me give you a couple of easy feeds. So I'm going to really work on the loop now. Well, you already have a loop, but it's uh, like the, the way you do it. You're doing like more the... See, there was a traditional phase on the modern forehand where yeah. it went from like going like this yeah. to going like this. Uh, okay. And then it, it turned into this on the modern forehand. Got it. So you got to modernize it just a tad, okay? Now, you don't have to exaggerate, by the way. Like, you don't have to bring it way up over your head it's unnecessary to just go like this okay all you got to do is look all you got to do is just here stay here with the with the top of your racket it doesn't even require you to raise your hand it's just that the tip of the racket needs to be like up more here we go there it is very clean 